Yeah, exactly. I was I was too quick on those cycles. That's the problem with this game is you, you have to be right in the uh, locked into the Goldilocks zone the entire time. You can't be too quick. Can't be too slow. You have to be right on cycles. So like when you first pick up the game and you're thinking, oh, it's a rhythm platformer. It's be like a rhythm game. And then you play through it and you realize it's like, hey, it's not really a rhythm game. At least not what you might have expected from a rhythm game. It's more precision platformer. But then as you try doing the, the speed run, once you really d dig deep into the speed run, you realize it turns into a rhythm game again. And that's why there's a timer on the level. They, they very much made these levels so that they were optimal if you could perfectly execute them with inputs. It's pretty cool. That's why I like it. It's super satisfying to get the speed run down. But casually, you're going to come to this game and be like, what the heck is this? <laughs> All this stuff on cycles is like frustrating. Why am I playing this right now? Thankfully, it's a short game. And very cheap. Slash free. Or you can just listen to the soundtrack, which is a banger by itself. Alright, this is better. It's later than I want to be, but better. Still made this cycle, so we should get a 132. Or a 131. Alright, Kai. Enjoy your food. Time to suffer. This level is on the tightest cycle, that's why I call it suffering. If I lose any time in this level, it's it's essentially a reset. If I miss the cycle with the moving platforms toward the end of the level, it's automatic four seconds lost. Get up there. That just made it harder to make it to the cycle. Okay, this should be fine. That's not fine. So now I'm one cycle behind here. Oh, I got that jump, thankfully. I think that saved it. One forty six bucks. So I'm one second behind. It's fine though. One second is better than four.
Gaming. Remember to hydrate. Hey, another shot at level 4 tonight. We love to see it. Nope. Big time loss. This is now 5 seconds of time loss. Assuming I get the drop. Uh, that makes world record extremely unlikely. Possible, but unlikely. Yikes, only five seconds to play with. <laughs> yeah, we'll just gold the rest of the level, sure.
Thank you for the good luck. Thank you for lurking, Sancho. Needed that. That was only what seven hundredths off of gold. <sighs> Le triangle. Alright, tied with world record going to uh, level 7. I'd prefer to be ahead right now, I should be ahead, but we are now on best pace we've ever been on, I think, going into 7. Pretty cool run. This is the third good run tonight. Ah, uh, damn. Well, it's dead. <laughs> I'll still go for PB, though. I was bound to lose the run somewhere along the line at the beginning of seven. That rope fling is not easy. Um, I don't know what cycle I'm on here. I'm going to take the safe route.
can still get a 1451. Okay. I mean, it's, if I got a perfect level eight, I could get a 1449. Dang. Level seven. Like I said, that's why I like getting into level seven with a little bit of breathing room. Instead of having to perfect every level. Oh no. It's been a while since I messed up the ropes. I don't know if this is PB anymore now. No, I don't think it is at all actually. A shame. It's going to be very close if it is. <laughs> PB by less than a second. Heck yeah. <laughs> That's how you PB. <laughs> the mightiest PB. Hello, YouTube. <laughs> You did help, Sancho. Thank you. Thank you so much for the GGs, everybody. <laughs>